Hey guys, welcome uh, to the first edition of Chairman's Corner uh, here on YouTube. It's a pleasure joining you guys here here tonight. Um, first thing I want to want to get off my chest here: um, condolences uh, to the Moran family. Uh, good friend of the YRs, uh, Barbara Moran, who is um, she's also president of the Franklin County Ninth Ball Patriots. Um, one of her close relatives passed away today. I uh, just want to send a shout out to Barb. Let you know we we're, we're thinking of you. Um, and you're in our you're in our thoughts and prayers. Uh, a few things to talk about here today. Um, normally I would address this stuff on Facebook, uh, but I want to kind of go with a, a different theme. Um, so we're going to start uploading the YouTube videos, um, just talking about not only stuff here in Franklin County, um, but stuff you know across the United States, um, and then even foreign policy. If we get into that. Um, but the, the, the most interesting thing to talk about, I think, really, is the, the U.S. Senate primary um, in South Carolina today. Uh, Lindsey Graham um, is running for re-election um, with six opponents uh, in the Republican primary with Nancy Mace, Lee Bright, um, Ben Dunn, Bill Connor, Richard Cash, and Debt Bowers um, all opposing him. And then also uh, two Democrats vying for that nomination. Um... I'd like to get you guys' thoughts on this whole this primary in South Carolina. Um, it, it, it'll definitely be interesting to see what, what the outcome is. Um, obviously, I have an opinion on that. I'm not going to voice it, but I have an opinion on it. Um, but I wanted to raise that question, uh, get some thoughts. Um, comment in the comment section below of this video. Uh, let me know your thoughts about that South Carolina primary. Um, local news uh, to bring up. Um, the Franklin County Young Republicans, or excuse me, Franklin County Republican Party Chairman Dwight Wideman um, has decided to step down um, from his post. Um, I will comment on this one. Um, without trying to be completely rude, uh, Dwight, I wish you the best in all your future endeavors. Um, but back to the political and business standpoint of it, I'm happy. The Franklin County Young Republicans have been pushed aside um, at all costs. We're not included anymore. We're called a fringe group, a renegade group. And my plea is for the next chairman to use the Young Republicans for what they are. We've always been the workhorses of the party. That's never changed. The only thing is that's changed is that we've been pushed aside. Um, and I, I would ask the next chairman um, to please use us. Uh, we're here, that's what we're for, and that's why we help the Franklin County 912s, because that's what we're here to do. We're here to work. Um, but also, if you would like to comment on that whole situation with the chairman Weidman stepping down, um, who you would like to see as a possible replacement, or your thoughts just on Dwight um, as his time as chairman, um, again, comment section below. Let us know your thoughts. Um, if you would like to keep up to date with the Franklin County Young Republicans, um, follow us on Facebook or Twitter, uh, twitter.com slash fcyounggop, facebook.com slash fcyounggop. I'll put the, uh, I will put the links in the comment section. Um, and then we also have an Instagram account um, to keep you updated with, with pictures of, of what we've been up to. Um, but um, continue to keep in touch. Uh, that is enough for this version of Chairman's Corner. I will try to keep this up uh, once a week. Um, if I get slack behind, let me know, and I'll try to try to step it up a little bit. Thank you, guys. Um, God bless and take care.